Hey recorder players, welcome to week 8 of Recorders Without Borders. This week we are going to be learning a song from Korea called Ararang and it sounds like this. What a beautiful song, right? I can't wait to teach it to you. But first, we're going to learn a new note, recap some stuff in the recorder, warm up, all that good stuff. Let's get started. We're going to begin this week by learning the new note, then we'll use it as part of our warm up, okay? So, do you remember a few weeks ago I taught you uh, note D, this one right here, three fingers in both hands. Um, we're going to call this low D now because the new note I'm going to teach you is, is, a, is a, also a D but higher up, okay? So, let's rewind to last week, note C. So, I want you to find your note C fingering, okay? So, remember, you, you can start with an A and take off the top finger, so you're just left with the thumb and the middle finger, okay? So to play high D, which is our new note, <clears throat> we have to take the thumb off the back of the recorder. So the only hole that we're covering is this second hole with the middle finger of our left hand, okay? So this makes the recorder pretty unstable to hold. <clears throat> so um, we really have to make sure that we are uh, supporting the weight of the recorder with our, our right hand thumb and then our third point of support is is uh, our face our mouth okay so it's kind of hard to demonstrate this one without that third point of support which is why I'm holding my recorder on my face okay so I want everyone to find this note you can do the the, the steps that I just did so start with a which I'm sure we all know very well by now take off the top finger and then take off the thumb and you have high D okay and it sounds like this Okay, so try playing this one with me. Um, it's a pretty easy one to play actually, because uh, we only have one finger to worry about, so um, I think you, you should all be fine. So here we go, high D. After three, we're just gonna hold it out together. One, two, three. So we're gonna add that new note, high D, onto the scale that we've been building up each week, okay? So now we have enough notes for a full scale and it's called D mixolydian, okay? D mixolydian, you don't have to remember that, but just in case you're curious, that's the scale we're playing, okay? So we're gonna start in high D, we're gonna go down all the notes that we know, down to low D, and then back up again, okay? So a quick recap of that, starting on high D, thumb on for C, of course, then B, a, G, our old friends, F sharp, now be careful of this one, F sharp to E, that's a strange transition, okay, make sure you get that one right, down to low D, then E, F sharp, G, A, B, C, D, okay? So, we're just going to play this nice and slow together, um, so we can stick with each other, uh, I'll give you a four beat count in, and we'll do one, one note per count. Okay, here we go. Good luck. One, two, three, four. Full scale. How'd you get on? Let's do that. Um, let's do that one more time together. Same speed, nice and slow. But in your private practice, you can um, speed this up as you like. Okay, practice uh, some de dexterity. So let's let's do the same scale together. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> After four, one, two, three, four. Okay, so that is, um, that's, that's a full scale, our first full scale. That's a great thing to uh, warm up with. You can play it fast, you can play it slow. You can start on low D and go up to high D and then back down, okay? Um, that's actually a more kind of common way to play the scale, but I like to start on high D because that's an easier note to start on. 
um, but you can switch it up as you like, okay? So warm up with that one. Every time you practice, you'll get better and better every time you play it. Um, let's go and learn Ararang. Let's learn Ararang together. Here's the notes we're gonna need for the song, okay? Low D, E, G, A, and B, and our new note of the week, high D. We're gonna start on low D. Tough note to start a song on, okay? So I hope you've been practicing this note. Uh, it's three fingers and three fingers, and the thumb. It's one of the lowest notes in the recorder, of course. Tough to start on, but um, practice and you will you will get it. Okay, so here we go. Starting on note, note low D, uh, and we're gonna go D, E, D, E, G. Okay, so check out my fingers. D, E, D, E, G. Okay, that's the first phrase. So, goes like this. Okay, so let's play that together after three. <clears throat> One, two, three. Okay, one more time. One, two, three. Okay, that's the first part. Next, we're gonna go on to this phrase. Okay, so that was <clears throat> A, G, A, B. Okay, A, G, A, B. <clears throat> so let's play this together. Um, after three, one, two, three. Okay, one more time. After three, one, two, three. And if we put those two phrases together, we get this. Okay, so just one close up of my fingers uh, for you before we play it together. D, E, D, E, G, A, G, A, B. Okay, let's try this together after three. <clears throat> one, two, three. Okay, that's the beginning. Um, straight onto the next phrase. So after we get up to that B, A, G, A, B, here's the next part. A, B, A, A, B, G, E, D, excuse me. A, B, G, E, D, E, D. Okay, let's do that. Um, let's do that together. So if you're watching this with your recorder, you should be copying my fingers every time I go for a close up, okay? Just a reminder. Um, a, B, G, E, D, E, D. Okay, one more time. A, B, G, E, D, E, D. All right, that's the next phrase. So let's play, let's play this part together. After three. One, two, three. Okay, <clears throat> one more time. One, two, three. Okay, A, B, G, E, D, E, D. Um, let's put all that we've learned so far together. So we get. Okay, that's the, the opening, opening part. So a lot to remember, I know. If you need to, uh, if I'm going too fast, just hit rewind. Actually, here's a tip. If you press the left arrow on your keyboard, it jumps back, um, I think 10 seconds, maybe five seconds. Don't quote me, five or 10 seconds. Anyway, it, it jumps back a little chunk. Helpful if you wanna quickly rewind, just kind of tap the left uh, the left arrow until you get the part you want, okay? So feel free to view these parts multiple times. Anyway, uh, whole opening section, after three. One, two, three.
okay? All right, let's learn the next section. Okay, so this phrase is quite long. I'm gonna break it up best I can. Um, but it starts on G, and we go G, A, G, A, B. Okay, G, A, G, A, B. Pretty simple. Let's play it together after three. One, two, three. Okay, you got it? One more time, one more time. Uh, one, two, three. Okay, so we're gonna keep adding notes onto this long phrase. Um, next up, we're gonna add an AG onto the end of what we just played. So we get um, G, A, G, A, B, A, G. Okay, um, not, too, not too tricky. Okay, all on the left hand. Let's play this together. After three, one, two, three. Okay, one more time. One, two, three. Okay, um, get your right hand ready. I hope you hope it hasn't fallen asleep. Next three notes are E, D, E. Okay, so we're gonna add those onto that big long phrase. Um, so the whole thing so far is G, A, G, A, B, A, G, E, D, E. Okay, so it sounds like this. Okay, so let's play that one together, nice and slow. After three, one, two, Three. Okay, almost done with this long one. Uh, to finish it off, G, A, G, G. Okay, so the whole thing with G, A, G, G on the end is G, A, G, A, B, A, G, E, D, E, G, A, G, G. Okay, super long phrase, but once we learn this, we've, we're pretty much, we're almost done with the song. Okay, so here we go. We'll play this a few times through. After three, one, two, three. Okay, one more time. One, two, three. Okay, let's just do this one more time for luck because this is a long phrase. One, two, three. Okay, so that, that phrase actually is gonna come back pretty soon, so really don't forget it, because it comes, it comes twice, okay? So we've learned like the first half of the song, but the second half, um, there's a little extra bit to learn, but then the rest of the second half is the same as the end part of the first half, if that makes sense. So that phrase that we just learned, it's coming back. <clears throat> so second half starts differently, like this. Finally gonna to get to use this new note, okay? Okay, this is the opening phrase, so let's break it up. D, D, D. All right, that's our beginning. And it, they're all high Ds, so check my finger, okay? Just the middle finger on this second tone hole, right? Let's play this together. After three, D, D, D. Here we go. One, two, three. One more time. One, two, three. All right. Next part. Last thing to learn, and then everything else is a repeat of before. B, A, B. Okay, so adding B, A, B onto the end of that, uh, those high Ds. Okay, let's play that whole chunk together. One, 
two, three. Okay, one last time to make sure that's in the in our brains. Okay, hard to go from that high D to the B. That switch is a little tricky. I almost messed that up there. Um, now everything else after that is a repeat of what we've done before. So remember the phrase that went like this. Okay, that was from section one. Okay, so that was A, B, G, E, D, E, D. Remember this one? We played it about 10 minutes ago. A, B, G, E, D, E, D. Okay, so let's add that onto the, onto the D, 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 B, A, B, A, B, G, E, D, E, D. Okay, here we go. That whole chunk. One, two, three. Okay, now the big long phrase is coming. And that's the whole song. Okay, so let's remember that big long phrase. G, A, G, A, B, A, G, E, D, E, G, A, G, G. Okay, and that's how we end arrowing with me that big long phrase once again okay one two three all right so let's go back to the very beginning because i'm not sure i can remember how this song starts okay so let's just do a quick recap of everything okay D, E, D, E, G, A, G, A, B. Okay, remember that phrase from the beginning? Let's just, let's just play that one more time. We're gonna run through everything a little quicker now. One, two, three. Okay, now here's where the two halves are the same. A, B, G, E, D, E, D. Okay, one, Two, three. Okay, now the big super long phrase, starting on G. One, two, three. Now the high Ds to start the second half. D, 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 B, A, B. Okay. One, two, three. Okay, now here's where the two halves are the same. So we're going back to A, B, G, E, D, E, D. Here we go. One, two, three. Okay, now the big long phrase again. Here we go. One, two, three. And that's the whole song, okay? It's a bit long this one it's got it's got fewer repeats than uh, our previous songs much more to remember so this lesson really would benefit from uh, a few rewatches. um but let's pla let's let's just try playing the whole song together no track and then we'll go and put it with some music okay so the whole thing let's play it together no stopping no reminding okay um watch my hands and good luck here we go <clears throat> One, two, three.
Okay, hope you did great. I'm sure you did fantastically well. Um, let's go and put, put this with music, all right? See you in a second. Got my trusty backing track here. Um, I'm gonna hit play and you'll hear a one, two, three, here we go, okay? Just like that. Um, we're gonna play the whole song through twice and that's it, you're gonna be great. Okay, here we go, good luck. One, two, three, here we go. sounded great. That was uh, Ararang from South Korea. I hope you had uh, a lot of fun learning that, as much fun as I had teaching it. Um, this is Recorders Without Borders. We will see you next week for week nine. Bye-bye.